Also tonight, two men accused of hitting the jackpot at a local convenience stores, but not the legal way. Oklahoma City police are now investigating a crime ring involving what they call ATM jackpotting. News 9 crime tracker Jennifer Pierce has the details. Oklahoma County prosecutors have charged the alleged ringleaders of the ATM jackpotting scheme. Police are now working to identify the suspects known as the cash out crew. So these machines carry tens of thousands of dollars in cash in them. Police say that's what lured Johnny Romero and Danny's Ramirez to hit ATMs at OnQ stores around the metro. According to court documents, one of the suspects opened the machine and installed malware, while the other acted as a lookout. It basically instructs it to dispense all of the cash it has, and it does it uh, oftentimes in $800 increments. Police say the men would start the process and then the cash out crew would withdraw the remaining cash over several hours. Store security cameras confirmed the dates and times of the illegal withdrawals. The banks were unaware of the cyber attacks until several hours after $60,000 was stolen. It's important for the public to know that they're not withdrawing it out of some person's account. Police asked the public and store clerks to stay aware of unusual ATM activity. If a clerk at a convenience store, which is where this happens so often, uh, notices a person lingering at the ATM for half an hour, 45 minutes, that might be something that they want to be suspicious of. Investigators say the crimes could also lead to federal charges. At the Oklahoma County Courthouse, Jennifer Pierce, Oklahoma's own News 9.